this video and hundreds more like it available on free Photoshop video tutorials.com. In this video we're going to pick up where we left off with the graffiti for text and now we're going to learn how to use custom shapes to make it seem like that custom shape was added realistically, was added to the image. Uh, it was originally part of the photo and you didn't do it in Photoshop. So the way that we do this is uh, we have to create a new layer first of all, create a new layer above our image and now what we want to do is just go to our custom shape tool that's down here at the bottom and with our custom shape tool we want to load up um, a, uh, a, a, a section of your Photoshop comes with different uh, types of uh, pre-made uh, little shapes and what we want to do is just click on this little uh, arrow here and uh, bring up here our symbols so we want to do the symbols and click OK here we're not deleting anything else that we had once you're done with this if you want to go back to the original stuff just go to reset shapes click OK and you're, you're back to probably as you're probably finding it right now so it's just a matter of just loading up different different types of uh, different presets of shapes. So we're going to go for symbols here and click OK. And with the symbol here I'm going to do go a bit green here. We're going to do a little recycling thing so it seems like there's a recycling logo um, in you know as, as part of this brick wall here. So using white um, I'm going to hold down shift here to make sure that our symbol is going correctly instead of being squashed. Holding down shift we can make our uh, symbol as big or as small as we want. So I'll probably go for something like that that's a good size. If you want to further uh, do anything with the shape what you can do is just do a control and T and then you can uh, reshape it or you can uh, rotate it obviously you can rotate your image uh, make it smaller and so forth so once you're satisfied with that what we can do is uh, go to your paths if you don't have paths already uh, in your setup here go to window and paths to bring it up and now what we want to do is just hold down control and you can see the little hand icon there changes with the little box and we want to make a selection from that path so we're going to control and click now we have our selection making sure we are in our empty layer we're just going to fill this in with uh, white which is alt and backspace since white is my foreground color okay now that we have that done it's looking pretty good but now we want to add that effect remember uh, to make it seem like it's part of the brick wall so if you remember correctly what we did is we go into the effects here go to blending options and inside of our blending options, let me move this over here, it's the bottom part here, the underlying layer that we want to play with. We want to move down the slider of the black, the black slider, alt and click to split it. And then probably move your slider over to the right here, to the left entirely. And then start playing with your right slider to a point where you think it's looking pretty good. I think around here is all right, 138 for this image and I want to move around just a little bit of this um, the left slider here to uh, not have the text coming the, the the white paint here coming through the absolute darkest parts it doesn't seem realistic that the paint would actually stick to those parts so again I'm just gonna move this a little bit over here so that we got some absolute blacks um, and then the text the, the, the paint would start coming through a bit after that so now we just adjust a little bit of that probably didn't need much adjustment really there we are it's looking pretty good okay we click OK and uh, there we have it so we have our uh, image here our shape and it looks pretty much like it was part of that image if you enjoyed this video show your support by subscribing rating and adding it to favorites leave comments on our website and we'll create even more videos that interest you